India's moon dream is fulfilled. Chandrayaan's lunar probe with the tricolor lands on the moon. India's first major success in the space race. India is only the fourth nation to have completed the moon odyssey. The dress rehearsal now over for India's second mission, Chandrayaan 2. Chandrayaan 2 will happen as soon as 2010. This is certainly the beginning of a new chapter in the history of Indian space exploration. And the chairman of ISRO, Madhavan Nair, is understandably quite elated. Well, it's uh, one of the excellent uh, moments as far as uh, not only for me, the entire ISRO community and for the nation. And we are really proud that we have done it. Sir, uh, what exactly were the last uh, few moments like? At 8.06, uh, what about the, the actual uh, movement of the MIP? Was it perfectly on schedule? Well, I think uh, it has been uh, designated to the position of second. We have implemented it. And we knew that uh, everything was rehearsed. And uh, there was uh, probably the chance of errors were much lower. So the atmosphere was relaxed. But within about uh, 15 minutes, or 25 minutes, it was touched down as planned. Sir, uh, the landing of uh, the tricolor itself on the moon surface, how significant is it? It's really great. You see, Indian flag reaching our nearby uh, object, moon, it's a very, very great moment for the entire country. Sir, now you feel we, can, we have absolutely justified the, the, all the criticism about the cost? Cost already I have showed you. I have, I have not spent more than 3% of my 3 years budget on this program. It is the most cost effective program in the world. So the last question, now apparently we are going to the sun, there is a satellite being sent uh, called Aditya? No, I would like to correct, we are not going to the sun, it will burn up. So we are going to have a satellite for studying the effect of solar radiation and the Earth's atmosphere and atmosphere, that is called Aditya, and we are in the process of implementing that in about two years it will be on. And India will be hoping to send a man to the moon by 2020. Now, apart from mapping the surface of the moon, Chandrayaan will be looking for minerals, also trying to confirm the presence of ice in the polar regions of the moon. Here's former president APJ Abdul Kalam saying it may find something on the moon that could prove useful for man.